just by the school in Tolonia and the kids have just come out to say hello to us and you've never seen such a colourful, sweet-looking crowd of five-year-olds. Well, in fact, the whole school's come out to visit us, haven't they, Mum? We've come around the corner and we're standing here with lines of kids all wishing us a good day. Namaste. Yeah. Namaste. 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 Good morning. Mere naam Vicky hai. Apne khud hai ki? Tommy, Tommy. What's, what's happening here? They're going to plant all these trees. Plant. These trees. Where have they come? The villagers have given you these trees to plant. Yes, yes. yes. Just like in the memory that we had visited, so they want us to plant that. Be careful. It's so sweet. Now how do we do it? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. City dwellers. Okay, let's learn from there. Guys, tell me what this mirror, circle mirror contraption is. It's like a solar cooker thing. It's, yeah, it's all the sunlight to that. Uh, this is like the stove. Right. I'm so happy I'm seeing all this. You can see this uh, sun getting, you know, it's all concentrated out here. It gets heated and then you can cook food. See, you can feel the heat here right now if you uh, place your power. Wow. And it's not even really sunny, is it? Yeah, it's overcast. Yeah, yeah. In the morning the sun will rise this side, no? So they will put it something like this, uh, uh, directed towards sun. Yes. Now the sun goes in the west, this direction it will go. So it will automatically rotate towards sun. So there's a system of weights behind the yeah. concave this pendulum system is here. Yeah. So they set it in morning, and because of this pendulum movement, no? This also moves slowly and slowly towards sun. And yeah, there's a clockwork mechanism behind, yeah. which allows it to follow the sun during the day. Yeah. Automatic oh. it's automatically. Oh. Nobody does it man manually. It's simply complex. Simply, <laughs> simply complex. complex. Exactly. Yeah. It's beautiful. <laughs> Samia, so, yeah, are you impressed by this place? Very, very impressed. It's kind of hard to believe that this entire place came up with the villagers' own hands. They didn't go outside, they didn't ask for architects. And the architects themselves are villagers who are still illiterate. And that's, that's something we've never come across outside. It's very, very impressive. It, it's one of those villages which leaves you with a very good feeling and you feel very good about the entire world. But at the same time, it humbles you a lot. It brings you down to earth. And misproves the fact that villagers need not be ignorant. They can in fact be better than you. So And the whole village is solar powered, isn't it? Pardon me? The, the whole village is solar powered. Yeah. So they're powering twenty computers, I think we heard, and all of the fans and lights yeah. and cookers and so on. And it's so self sufficient. They generate yeah. the electricity that they need. They yeah. don't depend outside. And other people come here to train to learn how to implement so solar technology in their, exactly. their own villages. It's not only in India, but Africa, Africa, Bhutan, afield. yes, and South America. So they all come here. They all learn, and they don't give a certificate. Yeah, they believe that certificates are what pulls people away from a village to a city. Yes. I don't know. I really have no words. I'm I'm just amazed, and I'm gonna come back here. At least stay here for maybe a month or so. Really? Definitely. To just be here and learn? Yeah, just be here and learn. And then what would you do with that learning? Um, I told you I want to put up a school in a village, and I think this would help me a long, long way. Because we've never seen anything like this. There's no other village like this. And the fact that this has been emulated not only in India but in so many different countries. I think that, that itself speaks that this is something very different, worthwhile. So, yeah, I think it will help me a long way and I'm so glad we came here. I can see it in your eyes. It's a real inspiration to you. I, I actually had tears in my eyes when they were singing. I'm like, oh! <laughs> <laughs> That's it, so was, nice. it was very moving, very, very moving. I found it moving too. It's like those children singing songs which have such a deep meaning yeah. and so appropriate right now.
बच्चे हम देश के दुलार नन्हे मुन्ने बच्चे हम देश